Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Michelle Glendon. It is lovely to have you here. Today's video is going to be Secret Santa collaboration. Um, and the collaboration is with a whole group of uh, members from the Australian Vlogging Mums Facebook group. We all got together and decided that we would do uh, Secret Santa. So thank you very much to Mel. The, her channel is For the Love of Sorted. Um, she's another Queensland mum. So she was the one that organized and initiated the video or the collaboration. So thank you very much to you, Mel, and to everybody else who has helped along the way um, with getting everything organized. Um, yeah, so I'll leave her channel down below. I'll leave also all the other mums who are in this collaboration because there's quite a few. I think there's maybe around 20 different um, mums and what we just put our names in a hat. Um, there's a website called Elfster, Elfster. Um, pronounce it Elfster and everybody kind of like registers that they want to participate and then it gives you a secret Santa name so if next year or you're looking for some way to kind of get a whole group together to do a secret Santa like maybe all the adults in your family or something it's really a great way to go about it because then nobody knows who's got who and um, yeah anyway um, so that's good um, yeah so check out below all the other channels and um, right, let's get into it. I got my my parcel. It came to the, uh, it came a couple of days ago actually, but I'm only just getting the chance to film it. And I have been absolutely desperate to open it. I have opened the bag just because um, when it came, I could hear some clinking, and I just wanted to open it to make sure that that nothing was broken, um, and just to make sure because it didn't actually. It says it's from Adventures with Maddie, and I can, um, that's her channel name. Um, so I'll tell you a little bit more about um, her in a minute but at first I didn't actually realize as well that it was my secret Santa gift I was like hang on I haven't ordered anything <laughs> or I'm not expecting anything um, so let's have a look okay so ah, okay so there's two parcels the first one oh it's wrapped in newspaper how good is that I love it okay it's slightly cracked open maybe that's why the clinking was happening let's see Thank you, Maddie. This is lovely. I'm so excited to open a present already. All right. Oh, wow. Oh, it's a little, um, oh, it's lots of bags. I think these are produce bags or something like, you know, little, uh, oh, look at that. Yeah, these are, I'm guessing this is for shopping because there's also, um, yeah, so there are four metal reusable straws, a straw cleaner, and these little bags. So there's two of them. I probably should have opened the card first um, to see what the story is, but these look like, obviously these are like zero waste or, um, you know, reusable things. So I'm guessing that they're meant to be produce bags, like maybe buying an apple or whatever, or a bread roll or things like that. Um, oh, how exciting, that's great. I probably should open the card next. Okay. Oh, it says open last on it. <laughs> that's funny. All right, that's good. <laughs> so, um, okay. So then there's another little. That's all that's in there. This um, other. It's quite heavy. So another little gift. Let's see. Oh, I feel spoiled. Those straws are like quite expensive. Ah, oh, Goliath 100% natural soap, citrus clove, and bay leaf. Oh my goodness, that smells really good. Mmm, smells like Australian summer. Mmm. Right, it says natural bar soap, approximately 270 grams. Um, keep this soap well drained, as dry and as dry as possible between use to help extend its life. And then it's got an ingredients list, and it's by Dindy Naturals Skin Salvation Planet Protection, made by hand in Victoria, Australia. Oh, that's lovely. Look, and it's wrapped up. That's what it looks like. So it's a giant, a giant block of soap. Mmm, smells really good. Okay, let's see what the card says. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Oh, oh. It said, this card is alive. The Christmas tree inside this card is embedded with Australian native Swan River Daisy seeds. Oh, wow. So that's the card, it's got writing in it, and then there's this little piece of paper with seeds in it that you plant. You soak it, soak that little piece of paper in water until soft, place it in a pot containing good quality mi potting mix and lightly cover. 
The Swan River Daisy seeds will germinate quickly under warm conditions. Place the pot in a warm position and water regularly. More information can be found at Living Fundraisers. Oh, that's amazing. How, how thoughtful, what a great idea for a Christmas card. Okay, I'm gonna read you the letter because it's, um, she's written me a note, so I will read it to you. It says, Dear Rochelle, firstly, congratulations on the exciting news. Oh, I can't wait to watch your family grow. Oh, thank you, Maddie, that's really lovely. Secondly, I wanted to, let, um, to tell you about the present. Um, the presents for you. I know you are interested in the zero waste movement as well So I thought I would aim for that with these gifts. I make produce bags. Okay. I was right. Yes, they are produce bags these ones you make them That's amazing. I Make produce bags. So I thought I'd make you some too. I call these ones salad and mushroom bags as they're smaller Oh, that makes sense. Oh, perfect. That would be perfect. They would be perfect for like, you know, a a good meal of mushrooms um, but they work great for cherries too the straws are my favorite ever and have been a lifesaver this pregnancy that's right Maddie is um, pregnant as well I think she might have had her baby by now because I think her last post was 38 week update I also thought that you deserve to pamper yourself as well I hope I truly hope which is why the soap <laughs> I truly hope that you have a magnificent Christmas and New Year is is a beautiful one filled with many adventures love from maddie ricky and little ginger oh thank you so much that's so lovely and thoughtful yes you are right i do try as hard as i can i'm not always perfect at it but i do try to reduce our waste and not only our waste but more like um what i buy in the first place so i do have produce bags like this I take my own bags to the shops I've always got my own bottle of water I do on occasion buy a drink while I'm out like if I feel like a juice or something I do try to buy it in glass I do also have our own reusable some reusable straws but I don't have metal ones I've got um, silicon ones so this will be good and these these little suckers are actually hard to get hold of I find these straw cleaners um, the ones that like yeah anyway I'm always losing them because I think Max steals them out of the drawer. I do try my hardest. I'm not the best at it and I do definitely want to improve. So this is a great little motivation. Thank you so much. So yes, yeah, so Maddie is um, pregnant and she's been posting lots of videos about how to have a zero waste baby, like all the things that she's buying and doing um, in regards to trying to be lots more, a lot more zero waste, especially with pregnancy, which I have to say before I had Max, I found reducing our waste and being more mindful about what we purchase and the, and the packaging and everything um, was a lot easier before I had Max. And then I realized that sometimes having a baby, you just need to go line of least resistance and do the convenience option. Thank you so much again, Maddie. These are amazing. This soap, really good timing because I'm coming up to the end of my current bar of soap. So this will be brilliant the this will last me i reckon this will last me most of next year to be honest yeah i don't know if that says more about the soap or how little i wash my, myself <laughs> just just kidding just kidding all right thanks again for watching if you want to see some of maddie's videos and all the other mums participating in this collaboration please do check them out yeah, and so also to the mums who are participating in the collaboration it is always amazing working with you guys and collaborating with you i really do love it if you are an australian vlogging mum and want to join our little community just search on facebook for australian vlogging mums and it should come up um yep and i will uh yeah i look forward to having you in there um yeah thank you so much for watching i can't believe we're coming towards the end of vlogmas already i really appreciate everybody who has stuck by and commented and watched i know it's a really busy time of year so i really do appreciate it and i will see you tomorrow bye guys have a good day <laughs>